Day 10, I woke up relatively in a good mood. I had the Wagyu, the Wagyu beef burger left over from my purchase at the butcher shop. And I did the same thing as the first day where I used all of the runoff from the beef fat that was in the pan, stuck it in a little bowl and used it as dipping sauce for my burger. It was fantastic. Melted a bit of cheese on that and had, I think it was three boiled eggs with that, as well as four strips of bacon. It was delicious. I've been doing this thing where I twist the bacon strips and stick them in the oven until they crisp up and I call it bacon straws. So the bacon straws are great. And that fueled me enough to have one of the best recording sessions I've had in ages despite the fact that I was coming off of a red eye the night before. So a massive positive effect that I'm finding of eating this way is that the anxiety levels are just going down and down and down. Having my body properly fueled is something that's contributing to my well-being, my happiness, my ability to stay calm and focused, especially under situations of stress. So I walked into the studio, the owner was sitting in on my session, which normally would have just made me so nervous. And I ended up doing my very first take where he was like happy and thrilled and sold. We did, however, have a longer session because we tried out a few tweaks to the script and things like that. But all in all, walked away feeling like a million bucks. Then I decided I couldn't stand being in Montreal, so I booked a last minute ticket and got out of there as fast as I could, which set me up for another red eye. I was prepared for my flight. I had some beef jerky. I had some hard boiled eggs. I also had had enough time to cook up a nice big steak. I cut it in two so that I would have half of it for supper at the airport and then half for breakfast before my next flight. I ended up having a really good sleep despite the fact that I was sleeping on a bench in the airport. That's changed, I think, the quality of my sleep or rather the, rather the, not the quality, but the, it's like I feel more rested even if I'm getting shorter sleeps. So that's changing where, yeah, even if it's like a four hour stint, I feel so much more rested and it's almost like that four hours is worth six or seven of my old hours. So that's an interesting development. That's an interesting development. I forgot 